Yo, 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 what is up? So before I go to bed, I'm going to make a little video. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm going to make this a quick video. I'm going to do a little tag, okay? Tag's called the mixed race tag because I am mixed race. Um, And so here we go. Question number one. What are you mixed with? Uh, my mom is... Palestinian, Jordanian, and Egyptian on her mom's side, and Norwegian and English on her dad's side. My dad is English, Scottish, German, and Irish. So that's so I'm Arab and British. Okay, simple enough. Okay, so that's that's what I am. All right. So what am I mistook for? Spanish, um, Puerto Rican. Um, Italian, French, Mexican. Like some people even have mistook me for Yupik, and I ain't even Yupik, you know. Um, yeah, but that's what I've been mistook for. Now, which, which background do I feel closer to? Which background do I gravitate more towards? The Palestinian side, you feel what I'm saying? Because I grew up with my mom's side of the family. Um, my dad wasn't around when I was growing up. Uh, largely because of his job. And then <laughs> also because of his parenting skills and his relationship with his mother-in-law and with his wife. So that's why he wasn't really around. So my mom's my mom and my mom's parents and my mom's younger brother raised me. So shout out, big shout out to my Sidi and Siti. Um, cause they raised me. You feel me? So especially my Siti, my Siti. She she was she's my biggest supporter. Always has been. So you know what I'm saying because both of her parents were Palestinian, predominantly. Right, her dad was a Palestinian Bedouin from Gaza, from Khan Yunis, from that area around there. Her mom was from Hebron, so that's why I gravitate more towards the Palestinian side of the family. You feel what I'm saying? Um, and I grab and and that's why I feel closer to them you know i'm not that close to my dad so that's why i don't feel as british as i feel palestinian you know so that is yeah that's basically that um and what was it like growing up man growing up mixed race as half palestinian half english was like an identity crisis man i tried to fit in with everybody I try to fit in with the Mexicans, the Puerto Ricans, uh, the Peruvians, Dominicans, Colombians, with the Yupiks, with you know people from all over, from the with the Samoans, from the with the Tongans. Like, pic picture my little light skinned ass trying to fit in with them. Like, hell no. <laughs> no but uh, yeah, that's it was it was like an identity crisis for me, and then. Like, after I dropped out of college, I just really embraced myself, who I was. And, yeah. And, yeah, growing up, I definitely got a lot of shit from people, you know, for not looking a certain way or people expected me to act a certain way. My dad, his family, all his family expected me to act white. And my mom's family is kind of whitewashed, so same thing with them. So, you know what I'm saying? So it's like... Just being myself, being like who I am, that's honestly like the most I can do for myself and it's most other mixed race people can do for themselves. So yeah. And that's pretty much the mixed race tag and your boys out here. Peace. And by the way, subscribe, like, comment, and share on Twitter. Peace.